Welcome back, folks. We are going to head out and attack Amble Peak in the next one. But first, I just realized that I want to move four of you down and move four of you up. So that uh, Greasus has the best army that he can possibly have. Let's just pull you back there. And now Greasus has a lot of Noblar trappers, which is great for our missile units. Uh, for missile damage, you might say. Uh, so that is fantastic. And I think it's time to end the turn. And we are going to go attack Olag, Elf Poker, and the others. Rival power comes to parley, demanding a change in your mutual relations. Uh, Consider their offer carefully. Military access, where are they? They're down here. Uh, I will give you a counter offer uh, with a... Uh, a trade agreement and a non-aggression pact and they'll then give us 314 and we'll get some trade income which is great and we will propose this fantastic we have a sort of friend all right so signing an aggression pact is done Wonderful. No and now it's time to go after uh, Amble Peak. It is time to go after Amble Peak. Let's see. It's a valiant defeat, it says. I have a lot of Noblars. Uh, a few other things. Uh, well, um, more Noblars than anything else. Some Mornfang Cavalry, Orga Bulls, uh, of uh, different varieties. I think we're going to encircle because... Why not? Let's encircle. And you can recruit... And I think we're going to recruit some... Iron Fists, maybe? Yeah, let's do that. And we have a building upgrade available, so we can build a new building here in the Great Hall of Croesus. Uh, loot pile 200 income that is very very nice uh, let's get that Okay, and let's end the turn. Oleg Elf Poker, I like that name. Don't go thinking you can talk us out conquest. Okay, what do you want? Trade agreement? Uh Payment of one, sure. Uh, I'll take it. Olga intelligence is under Yes, it is. All right. Karakasorn is sundering out. 
We need to kill this uh, Thin Grim Iron Will guy as well. The Baleful Prince. Okay. I'll turn you to awful, Master Butcher. I don't think we're going to record. we we'll recruit anything else here right now. Um. I do think we are going to attack here. Uh, I don't think we're going to auto resolve, even though it does say that we're not going to lose anyone. I want to fight the battle. I want to fight the battle. Alright, a lot of Noblars is the enemy. And whatever these guys had, I didn't actually notice. Okay. Alrighty. We are in. Yeah, yeah. Uh, why is all you want? Uh, let's take... Let's see one, how many do we have? One, two, three, four... We have eight Noblars, so you'll be one. You'll be two. Uh, you'll be three. Four. And then I think we'll do something like this. Okay. So. We're all down here right now, which I don't want to be. I want some of us to be over here. So that we can come in from this direction. Alright. So you go there. Uh, you go there. And you go there. Yeah. Okay. And we'll send you three over here as well. All right. Then we have you guys. We will come over here. And we have you, big boy. You can come over here. Gracious get in the back and Got you four. Out, can come in here. Actually, come in here. All right, let's start the battle. And we'll grab Thank everyone. You. And move forward like that. Over here. We'll take everyone and move forward like this. Okay. So far, so good. Uh, why don't you go play with them? Let's shoot at the ogre bulls here. And then you can come up here like this. I don't know why one of them is moving way up there. All right, Stonehorn is having fun. Let's get you in here. Okay, 
Okay. Their guy is uh, taking quite a bit of damage. He's fleeing. And over here... You get in there. You get in there. And you get in there. Alright. How's our Stonehorn doing? It's actually taking quite a bit of damage. But it's also doing quite a bit of damage. I really don't want to lose that, so we might we need to keep an eye on that. Uh, you guys come in here. And we'll grab you two. And we'll send you in to fight that guy together with you. How's the Stonehorn doing? Taking some damage. Let's send. Well, let's get you guys up here. And I think you guys can come over here and help. Is that our guys that are fleeing? It is. Okay. Don't flee. We'll win. Uh, he's taken a little bit of damage. Okay. Over here. We are fighting Gar. And you are shooting him. Uh, let's move up here. In my sight. And Guts out, boy. Whoa, my stonehorn. Get out of there, stonehorn. Stonehorn. Get out of there. We're gonna lose the Stonehorn, aren't we? We are. Dang it. That wasn't part of the plan. Yeah, I think we lost the Stonehorn. No, it's there. It's trying to get out. Run, Stonehorn! There we go. It's out. That's good. In here, we're tearing them apart. Take it all! Got yourself, boys! Uh, let's... Come down here and attack those guys. Their Gar guy is almost dead. Master Predator! It's happening! Alright. Is our Stonehorn still alive? It is. It's gonna pull back here. Killing time. All right, we captured any victory point, and we are victorious. Man, we were close to losing the Stonehorn there. As in, really, really close. But it did kill 102 units. MVP again. Croesus, 80. 
Our Noblars didn't really do that much, which I didn't expect them to. Okay. Okay. We lost 343, so it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that bad. I mean, their losses weren't that much worse than mine, but they did lose. So it's all good. Close victory, but a victory nonetheless. We've got some meat. We've got some loot. We've got quite a bit of experience, which is cool. And we are going to occupy... Big name unlocked, okay. The Brawler Guts, okay. Cool, cool. We have the Ivory Road. Nice. Plus 5,000 treasury. And we got Great Skull. Armor plus 15. Spell resistance for 10%. It's not bad. And armor of silvered steel. Plus 20 armor. Plus 50 or plus 500 treasury for belly thunder into each armor you control has 40 meat which we do and tyrants with titles earn five big names across all characters noise you capture two provinces main control of two provinces either by the which provinces Ah, uh, okay. Doesn't matter. So we just need to capture another one. Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's take a look in here. Gold hoard. Alright, I like that. Uh, we can upgrade that so that we get 150 income. Let's do it. Um, and I think it's in. No, you have that, so it's in Grimtop that we want the uh, meat generation. <laughs> okay. Very cool. What's our control light? Minus nine. Ouch. That's not so good. That is not so good. But we do have the commandments now, so... Crude ingenuity. Corruption minus five. Recruitment cost minus five percent. Local recruitment capacity plus one. That's not bad. Hmm. Come from all buildings plus five percent. Control plus four, uh, minus 20% for enemy army starting their turn in this region. Growth plus 20. We're going to go with growth plus 20 for now, so that we get this growth going. Uh, let's recruit some units for you, maybe. Or not. Let's wait. There's no gap. Uh, this is fine. You have a level. I think we're going to go with Tribe Stealer for the extra relations with the Ogre Kingdoms. Yeah. Let's go with that. You have a level. Um, increase mobility, for sure. Oh, and uh, big names. Big names. So we've gone with shockingly obese, uh, which I'm happy with. I don't want to change that. I really don't. Let's 
so all right seems pretty good what's our uh, mass can we see our mass somewhere don't see it don't suppose it's in here nah Gracious, the shockingly outburst. All right, uh, so right now we have the gambler's armor. Uh, I think I'd rather have the armor of silver steel. Let's get the potion of toughness in there. The old uh, you can have. Time. What didn't we give you? The Try armor of silver to... steel. Tried yeah, you have the armor, it's so good steel. So you can have Armor Great Skull. Okay, painter experience gain plus eight percent. That's not bad. There's no gaps bigger. Let's give that to you. And why can't we have the cave painter? Is it because... Hmm. Do you have the cave Consume. painter? No. Ah, oh, it has to be a tyrant. Okay. Tribe Lord. Got it. Uh, you have a big name available. Big Bellower, leadership plus 8, melee attack plus 10, uh, missile strength plus 20%. I think I'm okay with this. And you don't have a big name because you basically don't have anything. Uh, can you get... No... So you can have that. Uh, no, you can't, because he has that. Fine. Alright. This is okay. And we have a lord that wasn't moved. That's fine. Let's just put you in, in camp. And... Skip that notification and end our turn. Okay. Wow. That's a lot of or of uh, dwarves. The Baleful Prince is coming in. Special sauce. The butchers have come up with something new, boss. Ketchup, they call it. It's red but ain't blood. Comes from something called a tomato. Don't make no sense. Tribes are going crazy for it, though. What do we do about it? Uh, meat generator minus two all armor. Recruitment cost minus 25% all armies. Or we don't eat fruit and veg. Uh, growth plus 20 all provinces. We don't eat flesh. Alright. Control plus one in the local province. Rhesus. Okay. We got a weapon. A scepter of titans. Upkeep minus 5% lord's army. Income from post-battle loot plus 10. Recruitment cost minus 10% bonus versus infantry plus 4. Ability. Uh, scepter of Titans. Armor piercing weapon damage plus 75% bonus versus large plus 24. That is very, very nice. The pretense of amity is working. There are rival powers that may be willing to open trade negotiations. Consider making an agreement. For money oils the machine of war. Okay. Uh, I can do that. would be strengthened by the raising of a new army. Appoint another command. And you can open a second front against your foes. Uh, I have opened a second 
uh, opened another command. I guess I was a little bit early in doing that. Um, let's take a look at Greases here. Uh, he actually leveled up again. Gold Tooth Armor plus 8 Lord's Army. Use it plus 4 Lord's Army. Let's go with Gold Tooth. And... You have the Blood Cleaver. That ability sucks. We're going to use the web, the Scepter of Titans instead. And... Then I suppose... The Blood Cleaver can go to you. have the gambler's armor but that can you use the gambler's armor you can okay fine all right let's try and make a trade agreement where are the sargs they're up there uh see quick deal the sargs and we want a trade agreement one slaughter master's ingredients, uh, another slaughter master's ally. Trade agreement. He'll pay us. Let's My do it. Gratitude. And who else can we... Oh, mine. Can we trade with anyone else? I guess not. But we got this done. So that's an extra thousand in the treasury. Let's just see. Uh, Thunder Guts. Uh, we're already trading with. Fulg. Where are you? You're up there. Uh, let's make a trade agreement. Yeah. That's the ogre spit. Okay. And then blood more. Boss. Need something done. Oh, do you want to trade? Me. No. Could do an un a non aggression pact with them. Nah, uh, not right now. Okay. Uh, so, we're doing well here, and I think we'll go and attack these guys. That won't work. Like, Get him. there. Yeah. Alright. Let's just it's auto resolve this. Rampager standard, okay. Uh, banner of swiftness. Um, let's give the banner of swiftness to you. We'll give the gleaming pennant to. I think one of you. And then charge bonus plus 25. Alright, we'll give that to you. And let's replenish. All right, we got a pit fighter. Experience gains plus five percent. Okay, let's take a quick look at that. So pit fighter. Okay, he's already assigned to us, so that's fine. Uh, we didn't get any level ups. Must feast. Then we the enemy bring reinforcements to the fight. That's fine. An attack be wise. Yes, it will. Uh, auto resolve. We don't lose anything, but it's a big enough battle. I think that we're gonna fight it.
All right, so here we are. It wants to give us a tour of the unit types. I don't think that's necessary. Um, the whole kind of think uh, this is okay the way we're lined up. Yeah. Where are you guys? You're here, okay. Uh, so we'll. To you. I think we'll do you four. And then you five. And then you. No, no, control three. And you control four. Okay. So let's start the battle. We'll just let them come to us. I think. Has never lost a fight. And I don't intend to start now. Might as well let our noblars uh, do a bit of shooting first. Okay, Poison of Toughness, Scepter of Titans, and minus 8 leadership, minus 24 uh, melee attack. Okay. So that is going to be well worth doing. Alright, we have some kind of spell coming in. Let's see you get in there. Get in there. Uh, let's get you in there. You can get in there. 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 Uh, you get over here and fight him and you can get behind or on the flank more or less and get in here all right let's do this Okay. Did we? Enemy reinforcements are approaching. Attack with caution, Commander. All right. Me, me, Let's get you in there. Me. Where are reinforcements coming from? I don't see him. Doesn't really matter. Let's do a bit of mopping up here. He's running. Everyone is running. Basically. Alright. Let's pull you back. That guy is not doing well. Where is our hunter? He's there. All right. Man, our uh, stone horn is doing the nasty to them. All right, let's pull you back. Let's grab you. Alright, he's out of here. Let's waste some Noblars.
Okay, we have the reinforcements over here. That's fine, I guess. Okay. They are running again. I can't say that I blame them. They are taking horrible, horrible casualties. The strongest, the fattest. Uh, Hunter, Where are you? You're over here. All right, come over here. Get in there. Oh. My bad. Are we gracious? Go to. The more Okay, let's get in there. Uh, they are losing. They're dead. More or less, anyway. Okay. Our stone horn is just annihilating them look at it that thing is awesome and they are basically dead uh, they have Oleg here uh, let's get you up here and help these guys. Our poor Noblars are taking quite a bit of damage. Alright, we won. I kind of want to see if we can kill him though. I don't think we can. My next trophy. Uh, let's just speed up. Nah, there's no way. We're not catching him. All right, let's end the battle and see how we did. Uh, we lost 195. They lost 900 and well, a thousand. More or less. So yeah, I'd say that it was a decisive victory. It did say that it was only going to be a close one, but yeah, seems pretty decisive. Uh, One hundred and fifty-eight kills for those ogre bulls. One hundred and eighty-nine for the stone uh, stone horn. One hundred and thirty-seven for the iron guts. Uh, pretty good damage. Pretty good damage. Okay. Let's see what we get out of this. Um, and uh, just a friendly reminder that I don't really know much about Warhammer lore. Uh, lore. So um, if you are sitting there with a wealth of knowledge about Warhammer lore, uh, it would be great if you would uh, comment and let us know a little bit about uh, the lore of, of course, uh, most relevant right now is Grigus Goldtooth and the Ogres. Um, but any other kind of lore would be most welcome uh, as well. We would love to hear about it. Right. Alright, get a rank. 
I mean, we have tons of meat. So I think we're going to go unit replenishment. And we're going to see... Alright, trait gained. Assured assailant. So, leadership aura size plus 10% when attacking. Leadership plus 2 when attacking Lord's army. Not bad. Uh, pit fighter, another one. Experience gained plus 5%. Rampager standard charge bonus plus 25 and charge bonus plus 7%. Not bad. Standard of discipline plus 7 leadership. Enemy killed. Kus or Kus or whatever his name is. Okay. Cool, cool. Can we catch them? It looks like maybe. I'm gonna try. No, we can't. Dang it. Dang it, dang it. Alright, uh, over tyrant. Casual plus rate plus 5%. Recruit rate plus 1. Local recruit capacity. See, that's pretty good. So we'll go with that. Oh, um. Uh, uh, God, God Blout has. A level up as well so I, I'd like to get the uh, saber tooths um. I mean, minus 12% upkeep but then we don't have them yet but we will all right units are looking good uh amble peak uh, let's see you have the gold horde we can upgrade that uh I mean, the extra income is always nice, right? It doesn't give us extra meat. But I think it's worth getting the extra construction slot. So we'll upgrade that. Then over here, we have the guard tent. Room top. Uh, we can upgrade this, or we can get the saber tooths. But I'm kind of thinking that we want the saber tooths, and then maybe take the guard tent out. Or a saber tusk pack, it's called. I think that seems good. And what about the Great Hall of Greece's camp? We can build a new building here. Though I think we're going to wait on that. Because. Cap growth plus 10, that is really nice. Uh, but I want to upgrade this so that we can get some uh, more buildings in here. It'll grow in two turns and then we can upgrade that. And upkeep minus 60%? Heck yeah. So we're going to wait on that. Um, Actually, you know what? Because... Because we upgrade that and then we just get the Saber Tusk pack, but we all can already do Saber Tusks. Uh, so, cap growth plus 10 and local recruitment capacity. I think that's what we're going with here for now. 
All right. Uh, in Amble Peak, we've already done what we needed to do. So I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, Lord, not move. That's you. You can just stay in your uh, stance there. And that is going to be it for this uh, episode, guys. I think we've made decent progress. We took Amble Peak. We basically annihilated uh, these guys. Uh, what are they called? Uh, Dragos. The, these guys. We basically uh, annihilated. And. Cross Clubs is the name. And then I think we're going to go to war with the dwarves after that. We have quite a lot of meat. We have quite a lot of meat. This army is not consuming meat as it's within a camp circle of influence. Okay. Uh, what about this army? In the camp circle of influence. Okay, so the circle of influence of the camps is pretty significant. I wish I could see how big it is. So we have the camp here. But what's the sphere of influence? I can't really see that. I'd love to be able to see that. Okay, never mind. We are out of time. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.